a control system manages commands directs or regulates the behavior of other devices or systems using control loops it can range from a single home heating controller using a thermostat to controlling a domestic boiler to large industrial control systems which are used for controlling processes and heavy machinery there are three types of control systems pneumatic hydraulic and electrical control system let's understand about pneumatic control system first pneumatics is a technological term that focuses on the study and application of pressurized gas as an energy transfer medium used to facilitate mechanical motion when we talk about pneumatic controls or a pneumatic control system we are simply discussing a mechanical device or series of devices that use compressed air to perform a particular task a smaller sized stand alone or portable pneumatic devices may rely upon cylinder contained compressed gases that can include oxygen free nitrogen pneumatic systems are found in many industrial systems such as food industry petrochemical industry and industrial robots they simply require a compressed air supply a control valve connecting tubes and transducers pneumatic control system can be controlled both manually and automatically they are easy to install and has very simple design next in the line is hydraulic control system this type of control system uses fluid to generate power or energy hydraulic systems can be found in everything from cars to industrial machinery they are designed to provide power control safety and reliability hydraulic systems are made up of numerous parts the reservoir that holds hydraulic fluid the hydraulic pump which moves the liquid through the system and converts mechanical energy and motion into hydraulic fluid power the electric motor which powers the hydraulic pump the valves that controls the flow of liquid and relieve excessive pressure from the system and the hydraulic cylinder which converts the hydraulic energy back into mechanical energy hydraulic control system can be controlled both manually and automatically they are complex to assemble and any leakage in the system will always lead to pollution and last but not the least we have electrical control system a control system that uses an electric current either ac or dc or alternating current or direct current as a source of power supply is termed as an electrical control system they are simple system and are widely used in homes and industries